Hey everybody, Curtis here. Welcome back to Hell Architect. So, I've been playing this, and this is really kind of just like my first actual sandbox experience here. That I'm just kind of trying to process and put it all together. And the only conclusion I come to is that you can't lose. Like, am I wrong here, developer? Can you lose this game? Because here's the thing. So long as you keep, and it seems to be infinite, by the way. So long as you keep your sinners fed and keep them hydrated. There's nothing else that's really stopping you from losing. Because you only lose, really, when all your sinners uh, go insane or whatever the rule is uh, when they, you know, run out of stats. Like, you know, their, their food, sleep, and uh, sanity and all that. I'm sorry, I gotta get down here and collect all these, too. Basic ladders, please. Ladders! Anyway, because we need to collect these crystals. These crystals are specifically for research. You research new ways to torture your sinners and upgrade uh, existing uh, buildings that, you know, produce food and whatnot. Do, 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 do. Mm, dirty poop water bucket. Anyway. You guys gonna get this stuff or what? Yeah, give me those crystals. You cannot reach that one crystal. I mean, we are for real. No, no. There we go. Just build that ladder. There you go. You dirty little sinner. Now, the way you collect suffering, by the way, is you match the sinner's trait. Like right here, they don't like they don't like they're claustrophobic. So you use a torture device that works with that. If yeah, if I have one, um, furnace, freezer, <laughs> tartarus taint slapper. <laughs> uh, that's funny. Brazen bull. Wait. No, that's a fire. Fire, blood, none. So this is kind of neutral. Cold. Waterboarding. Oh, that's that's actually pretty mean. Uh, oh, the dentist. Nice. Catapult. Concrete boots. That's cold. A pillory. None, none. Oh, here's one. The Endless Fall. This is for your claustrophobic people. I have to research it. Well, I don't have that much to research. Hmm. Simple train Coffee Mine. Interesting. Hmm. But you basically research more ways to get to get food and water to your sinners easier and also sleep. So like there's the beds like you can research better beds. Eh, which I might do because beds are OK. Let's research better beds. And basically you're just going to like hollow out areas like this so you can put down floor. And like a so. And your sinners will come up there and build it. Again, though, like the, the, the concept of the game escapes me too because why would people willingly build their own torture devices and 
stuff like that. You, these things, you would think in hell these things would already exist before you got there. <laughs> so it's kind of funny. Okay, there's people that need to uh, get cooking. Oh, okay. And what about you? What are you doing? What are you doing? Where are you going? Can somebody get down to the other cooking thing and cook? Alright, so I need some more, just some more food makers. I believe I made a better production building. Didn't I? Yes, the mushroom farm. Which I made. I made this. Where would I put it, though? I don't know. Let's put a couple of them down, though, see what, what we get. Build! And this will allow my people to continue to produce food at the cauldrons. Mmm, radioactive looking mushrooms. And I think I need to build another trough. Trough. So that the sinners may eat. In fact, let me see about just producing a room that is specifically for the eating and drinking. You know what I'm saying? Up here can always be the producing. In fact, the production. It's, it's about being just about being organized, kind of like oxygen not included, but like you don't have to be that organized. So if I were to, like, how much does this produce? Mushrooms, okay. So I believe we're gonna just build some floor here. Um, no. Build. Floor. I did not. Burp. And we have that. Huh. I mean, they, they, these, like, the whole thing is odd. To say the least. Like the only lose condition I see you having is if you run out of resources. Like you've literally mined the whole map. There's nothing left to expand. Nowhere left to go. And so you're getting you're getting swamped by sinners that keep coming in every 10 minutes. At least that's how I kind of view it. Hey, give me those crystals. And in fact, it looks like you have to get just a little bit more over too. Okie dokie. It looks like we get the food and water coming back in, though. But to be honest, I don't know. Like, I played the tutorial on this. I know what's going on. But 
But I am just honestly flabbergasted by like the the a little the little too much of the open nature of it. So let's see, we still need actually more uh More food production. Because the sinners are definitely eating a lot. Hmm. Well... So if I were to keep production down here, so like, yeah, the trough, there it is. So we put down three troughs. Actually, we'll deconstruct these. Hurry up, please. Like I said, your sinners can just lose their mind and get gone, but it's rare, like, it's rare that it would happen to all of them. That's the point. Deconstruct that, please. Anyways, but we are going to build several more of these. Okay. I need you guys to get to work. Well, what's your issue there? Eat. Apparently, my people have not been producing their smelly goop. There we go. And by the way, and the system of getting water is also a little broken too. Uh, like I'll just point it out here. So like, okay, 10 excrements, right? One person. Now you would figure you have to wait for the same, the same center to give you more, but no, you don't. They will always keep on giving the same amount. Adding to it every time. Meaning you don't run out of uh, what you need to produce water. So, like, infinite water source. But uh, that should hopefully do it. Uh, build food. No. Build food. Put that there. There we go. Oh, 
And what's your problem? Uh, you need water. Well, go friggin' drink. <laughs> Or maybe that's the problem. Maybe we need more more buckets to drink. Do 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 do. Yeah, metal bucket. All right. More metal buckets. Are we happy? And now we're out of resources to produce food. Like I can see just like the food consumption, like getting way out of hand. And that's about it. But, but let me know what you guys think, honestly, because this is just kind of this is like I said, this is just my my first um, sandbox playthrough of this. I'm just kind of figuring it out, like what you should do, where you should go, uh, you know, digging wise, research wise, and I'm just kind of figuring it out. But let me know what you guys think. You want to see more of this game? You want to see me actually build a big personal hell um just let me know in the comments below and i will see everybody in the next video thank you so much for watching if you're new to the channel subscribe hit the notification bell punch the like button and i'll see you bye bye